So I'm Bob Williamson, a network administrator at Annie Wright School, Tacoma, Washington. It's a boarding school, so they uh, bring in private devices like crazy. Everybody expects everything to be on the internet. But as part of that also, we're seeing a lot more streaming. We gotta balance those two with QoS, because we've got so much streaming, but then the international students want Skype to their families. And uh, so it's really gotten to be the volume that's killing us more than anything else. That and the private devices. I was looking for something more advanced because it was obvious that the students were wanted private devices and uh, international calls and these sorts of things. It seems to me that the attacks are becoming starting from the inside and going out now, as opposed to back in the day, it would, the, the firewall was meant to block incoming. Now it's monitoring both directions. So I did some research and came up with Palo Alto and a competitor and tried Palo Alto in tap mode and took off from there. Without a doubt, it's the user ID information that we can get off of Captive Portal as well as the uh, user ID agent. So between the two, I can, I'm not worried about what device I'm working with, I'm worried about the person. And this way, it's device independent with all the user ID options. These, these students, these children come, and come into the school from all across the world. And so what we try to do is use our filtering and application ID to further their education and kind of teach them as they grow older and mold their brains, so to speak. Uh, so we're acting more, not so much as a Child Protection Act, but more as a parent. 